Hey guys, this is Patrick. Uh, just back out at the bridge, the viewing platform that I was at yesterday, just a little over 24 hours ago. And uh, if you haven't been watching the news, uh, the river has gone up quite a bit since yesterday when I was down there. I was standing right about here and I pointed out down there where people were standing. Uh, that you can see is the street where the trees are is the sidewalk and on the other side of that is where the river is and it was about two feet three feet below the sidewalk over there but since yesterday uh, it has come all the way up to the streets in fact if you look at the Sheridan there that's the Sheridan that with the two spires the golden spires it is at last I saw today I can't see it from here but I know it's almost at the doorstep if it hadn't gone into that building by the way that cart that you see and going by that's a, the Yangtze River Cableway it's about a two or three minute ride to the other side but the river has gone into I'm gonna just point I'm gonna pull back a little bit this where these lights are is a street right there is a sidewalk on the other side is a sidewalk and uh, this is parking the parking garage is flooded which I'm sure anything that is lined at the river depending on the elevation has been flooded as well partly but yeah, it is definitely overflowed into the street. And as you can see, everybody is out here filming, taking pictures. Look at the bridge. I mean, look how many, I mean, from one side of the bridge to the other, there's people that are taking pictures and watching from above. Yesterday, I had mentioned in the video that, that I was wondering what that meant. It's some kind of measurement. And, uh, it was about three feet below the top of that E yesterday, a little over 24 hours ago. And now it's almost above it. To give you a point of reference. That is Raffles City. That's that big uh, billion dollar complex, apartment complex, business complex. There's a mall there. That and all that whole front of that area has been flooded. On the other side of where downtown is, is the Jialingjiang River. And there's other famous tourist spots over there like just on this side not this side but the other side is Hong Ya Dong I've seen some videos and pictures of the parking below Hong Ya Dong flooded as well so they're definitely getting a lot more flooding here we have we had a little rain last night uh, but it's all coming from upstream and coming through Chongqing and as I said yesterday, guys, this is just a very sad event that's going on here. You know, my concern is as it gets further downstream, how is it going to impact the dams? Because the, the dams have been hit pretty hard, but so far they've, they've stayed up. So just keep everybody in your prayers. We're safe. Fortunately, we're on the other side of the mountain and there's not, uh, we're, we're, at, we're at a much higher elevation, so. Th those things that look like birds flying around, they're actually bats. A ton of bats here, which is great because it keeps the mosquitoes away. Look at all the, the river debris, the mud. It's just crazy. Actually, I'm going to zoom in on that. What is that? It's like a basket or something. But yeah crazy guys that's it for me just wanted to give you an update